Lagoon Beach at the Marine Corps base at Camp Lejeune, North Carolina. The area around here is rich with history. History that involves pirates and missiles. Let's head over to Topsail Island and I'll show you a little bit of what I'm talking about. Welcome to Topsail Island. That's how the locals say it, but it's actually spelled Top Sail, which leads to the story of how it got its name. Back in the days when pirates freely roamed the ocean, they would hide behind the island in the inlet to watch for merchant ships to attack. The merchants, however, soon found out what they were doing and learned they could look for the top sail of their ships so they could be warned of the danger in time. You've probably heard of one of the pirates who operated in this area. He went by the name of Blackbeard. Local legend even has it that he buried a treasure on this island, which has led lots of treasure hunters here. The largest of the treasure hunting operations packed up and left mysteriously in the middle of the night, leading a lot of people to believe that they found Blackbeard's treasure, but it has never been confirmed. I'm standing in front of the building where they assembled the missiles. In 1946, the U.S. Navy took control of Topsail Island from the Army's Camp Davis. They wanted the island to conduct Operation Bumblebee, a top secret program for the development of guided missiles. The missile testing was monitored by a series of eight observation towers and a control tower. The control tower is the white three-story building you can see behind me. The launch pad for the missiles also still exists nearby, but now it's used as a patio for a local motel. Originally, there were eight observation towers, but now only seven remain. Tower number eight was demolished in 1989. Tower number three, as you can see behind me, is a good example of what the remainder of them look like, though some of them are good enough to be incorporated in businesses and beach houses. Operation Bumblebee was a huge success. Through it, three missiles were successfully developed. The Terrier, the Tartar, and the Talos, which you see behind me. Also, the Ramjet engine was developed, which is the design we still use today for all jet engines. It enabled the creation of the SR-71 Blackbird and the Space Shuttle. In 1948, due to the difficulty of maintaining the program in the coastal environment of Topsail Island, the Navy ended Operation Bumblebee. They returned the island to the local community and the tourist attraction we know now started to build. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like it and subscribe to my channel. And if you ever get the chance, come visit Tubsaw Island. You won't regret it. See you next time.